Welcome to Ukenic. In this video here we have a 2018 Honda Accord. And we're going to do, um, this is a hybrid and we're going to do a health check or a full system scan. So let's get started. We're going to use the Ukenic full system scanner. And what you need to do is, uh, once you have connected the OBD2 adapter to the OBD2 port, then underneath the dashboard which is on the left corner right there you can go to diagnostics go to Honda do smart VIN and then we're gonna select Japan where this model is done and you go to quick scan all systems do you want to execute this test it can take a few minutes basically that's what that's saying so we'll say yes so what this will do is going to go through every control unit that's on this car and um, it's going to tell us if there's any fault codes. So you can see engine control unit doesn't have any fault codes. Transmission of fault codes. Now when this is complete we can enter any of them. We can see if there's codes, fault codes with any of them. Um, you can see them here really quickly but you can also get a full report emailed it to yourself printed send it direct to your printer and print it um, you can save the report on the scan tool if you like so we're gonna let this finish so here the scan is complete as you can see a bunch of systems have full codes so what you could do is you can click this you can also click the name of it and then you can actually enter the control unit itself or you can read the codes dive deeper look at things at live data for example you know um, so uh, live data is gonna show whatever the control module you have entered it's gonna show you the live data from that control unit but what you can also do down here you can save it it saves it on the scan tool you can hit report I like to look at this because if you scroll at the bottom then you have the the uh, summary of all the full codes uh, right here at the bottom you know low tire pressure VSA system malfunction and then this code uh, for the hybrid control system as well. If we go back here, you can hit erase and it will go through all the control modules. It will erase codes that are stored, they're old, but codes that are current uh, full codes that will stay, stay there or they might clear and then as soon as you start the engine, they'll come back. Uh, so this is how you can run a full system scan on the Ucanic scanner. Here we're using this on a 2018 Honda Accord similar pro procedure as well for other Honda models so if you have any warning light on the dashboard or if you have any issues with your transmission or ABS or you have a bad wheel speed sensor uh, you can find out with this scan tool uh, for example here we're looking at the engine control unit has no fault codes but you can go and look at live data for the engine there's a lot of live data here this is too long of a list it's got over a hundred and 69 so 169 data points and now these data points do vary between models but if you hit ok here you'll see all those uh, all this data um, live and then if you started to drive um, you should have somebody else drive and then you can monitor this or you can record it here and then play this back later on the scan tool uh, that's something but here you can see everything map sensor oxygen sensor or pressure switch everything the engine monitors a lot of data um, this is a hybrid version so you could also go back here by the engine um, the hybrid control module I called um, IMA on the case of uh, Honda you can enter that for example and then you can like monitor the the, the hybrid uh, system so we can read codes but most importantly you can go to live data hit ok you can look at voltages temperature sensor status of DC DC converter uh, how much uh, amperage is being drawn from the H uh, have have voltage battery right now battery fan a lot of troubleshooting helpful data same thing you can do with engine control unit transmission ABS any control unit that's installed on the vehicle that's it. Thank you for watching Mechanic, where you can be the mechanic.